here I've got a power gear inverter bought off Amazon. Nice piece of gear. Turns 12 volts DC into 120, 110 volts AC to run some AC equipment. I use it mainly on the boat on my radio or CD player. Sometimes if we're out camping, I use it to run a light. Okay, on the back it claims that it puts out 110, 120 volts, 300 watts, 0.3 seconds, normally 150 watts it can handle. So you can see our output's only 103 volts AC, 103 volts. That could be a problem for some of your electrical equipment, but the output is pretty low on this thing. So now we're going to make sure my battery output's good enough or has enough power so the inverter can run properly and my battery voltage is 12.74 which is plenty of volts for this thing to run. Okay now you see we got a red light on the front of the inverter it means it kicked off. The thing is is when we turn the light on from the light switch the inverter continuously just drops offline. So evidently there's a big surge being caused. You can see a little blink of light and you can see the inverter cutting off. So the light switch probably got a big arc in there. So we'll turn our light switch on first and then we'll turn our inverter switch on. And the light works fine. So the inverter switch probably has a little better lead made so it doesn't have a bad surge. Our amps, we hooked up our amp clamp the light bulb and our amps read 0.46. Okay, amps times voltage. We know our voltage is 103. So amp times voltage 103 times 0.46. And we're going to end up with like 47 watts of power. So the thing runs our light, runs our floodlight. I also hooked a little small fan and it ran that. Um, it isn't perfect. It isn't right to specs, but this inverter only cost me like $10, $11 on Amazon. So it gives me the AC power on my boat or camping or wherever I want it. But for $10, I think you got your bucks worth. The only thing that you got to remember is you got to turn it on at the inverter. Hope you enjoyed this video.